Charlotte Mormon also is responsible for organizing and putting on the Avant-Garde Arts Festival in New York. For 24 hours, we um, had permission to use the John F. Kennedy Staten Island ferry boat. And it didn't stop. It went on its normal uh, uh, cruises back and forth from picking Manhattan up passengers. to Staten Island. Yeah, which is what we wanted. We wanted to, for all these new people to see what we're doing. It's silly for us to play for all our friends. So the Staten Island Fair, but we had it for 24 hours, and it was very difficult to get it because I had just been convicted, you know, for the topless case. But when I went to the Commissioner of Marine Aviation, he didn't know this about me, and and so and w which was very nice, you know, that he was able to uh, appraise our work and see if it would be okay. And he said, "Fine, great." And then after I was given permission, then of course it, uh, the Daily News and people like that started talking about, "Oh, how dare you give the topless cellos a ferry boat and all," but they stuck by me. They, they said that has nothing to do with the festival, and she is entitled to use this for the Staten Island Ferry Boat was quite difficult. Are you kidding? They had never had any kind of art. They never had, uh, uh, you know, even a, a beautiful, sweet Van Gogh. So I like to go to these different places so we'll reach new people. And so we certainly reach new people. The Staten Island people, some of them were very upset about it. Others uh, really did enjoy How it. How many artists and dancers and musicians participated in this? Oh, I don't know, about 200, maybe more. Some in a very big way, some in a very small way.
these great things going, you know, electronic art and, and uh, um, happenings and events and things going on the ferry boat for 24 hours. And passengers would get on, and they had to pay that nickel every time, though. You know, they couldn't, they had to get off and get back on. 40,000 people came to see us in the 24 hours, which is 29,000 more than normally get on the ferry boat on the Friday and Saturday weekend. Wow. And the Staten Island Ferry is still the cheapest transportation in the country. Yeah, it's still yeah. five cents. And it's still one of those beautiful rides you can have. So uh, I fell in love with it.